From the crime beat, a mother is mourning for the second time this year after she lost a second son to gun violence. Police report that shortly after midnight, a group of people had been sitting in front of an abandoned building on Hospital Lane when they were approached by a gunman who opened fire in their direction before running away. Now, authorities confirm one man was shot and was later pronounced dead at the scene by emergency personnel. The victim's mother, Rosalie Bain, told us on the scene that her heart is broken after this latest incident that claimed the life of her oldest son. Her youngest right. son, Terrence Roll Jr., became the first murder victim for the year when he was shot in the head around noon on New Year's Day as he and others walked near the C.R. Walker Senior High School. Right now, I can't explain the way I feel. Only God could get me through this right now. It's another one of my son I have to bury. I don't know where I could get this money from. And I need help, all the help in the world I need. But I still giving God all the thanks and the praise through the situation that I'm going through. I don't want everybody just to pray for me and my family just to get through this. Any parents who didn't feel this, I feel this twice within four months. It's rough. It's rough. This feeling is unexplainable.